All right, we'll try this again. I don't know what's going on, guys. I'm trying to figure it out. <clears throat> okay, so it's uploading faster now. Let's see if we can get the show on the road, shall we? So, um, I thought coming from my bedroom into the living room, is anybody on? I thought from coming into the uh, bedroom, into the living room, uh, from the, yeah, into, into the living room, uh, or guest bathroom, should I say, would fix the issue. Um, I didn't do that. Um, I reset my router. It didn't do that. I reset my phone. It didn't do that. I reset everything and now it's it's coming out so it's a bit blurry um i don't know if it's the camera or if it's the upload or what the fuck is going on here but it was irritating the shit out of me it's blurry on the on right here on my laptop i'm going off my laptop here i'll be able to see the comments that way you guys get the full picture again so i got on here alex what's going on fellas steve what's up arthur how's it going arthur will carter what's going on brother um, Kevin, what's going on, Kevin? Um, uh, who else do we have on here? Um, yeah, so, again, sorry for the inconvenience, uh, for the big hiccup there. I didn't know, I didn't know what, what had happened. Uh, it is what it is. That's how these live shaves go. That's why they're live shaves. <laughs> Without further ado, let's get into all those. Uh, we already wasted enough time here. Gonna go in with the aftershave, um, bomb as well. Um, he doesn't make aftershave splashes, and I'm going to be using um, a um, mentholated aftershave that I forgot. Fucking A. Sorry, guys. I'll be right back. Yeah, sorry about that. Moving from the other bathroom over here. I forgot some of this stuff over there. Um, all right, so Jeffries would be along, Alex says. Um, so, sorry about that, guys. Really am. Uh, brush of choice. I'm going to go in with my uh, eight ball from MV Shave. That's got a fan um, game changer. Um, no, Wolf, um, Black Wolf, not um from mv shave awesome brush um and today's um oh here um using uh, snake bite sorry from aftershave since uh will carter over at uh barrister man is no longer doing aftershave the time being because of covid they're um you know due to the lack there of um uh, alcohol um making um hand sanitizers hand sanitizers and stuff like that so um they're in a dry state i guess you could say um where the hell is the other razor? Forgot the fucking razor. Hold on. I got, um, I was going to use two razors today to see which one will go best with the shave. Um, so today I'm using the um, the push button push type. I'm not sure. I'm not very familiar with these razors. They are not mine. They are on loan to me from my brother uh, Ronnie McAlpin, or uh, as you know him as uh, Ronnie uh, as a uh, Captain and Finance Seven on YouTube. So uh, yeah, and if that doesn't work, I will be using the um, uh, valet again. And the reason why is because. I have despined a uh, gym to put in to um, into this razor, and 
I also have a spine here for another experiment if that doesn't go well uh, and use the feather inside the gym. Uh, all you got to do is put the spine on the gym. So since this razor does have um, the little dots here on the back and I just got a message from my damn dispatcher. So this phone will probably be ringing here in the next few minutes. Um, ah, I just can't get a fucking break. Uh, so I will do my best to make this go. If you guys see this turn off, um, I'm going to do my best to get back on. I am sorry, guys. Um, um, no, because I got to I gotta text him. And I don't believe I can get it from right here. Um, no. I can't do it from here. Where? Messages. And it doesn't have it on here. I'm not sure. Um, let me see. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to multitask here. So. In here? But I thought you said it doesn't, um, someone else. How the hell do you scroll down? You just go down. Boy, oh boy. I don't know what the fuck is going on. Oh, I'm sweating because I'm starting to, ah, getting fucking irritated. <laughs> getting irritated I'm trying to get this uh show on the road here anyways uh we got these little divots here on the old school ones that raises up the um blades that uh, uh that didn't have the sp uh, spines as thick as, as it did back then so i'm hoping it's gonna work without the spine we're gonna see I'm gonna go ahead and load it in here right now and um there we have it and oh sorry he gets the push cut. there you go and there we have it so um i figured that might work all right you know given that it's made for um the race that didn't have the um the big spines back in the day um so oh my god give me a second guys i'm trying to multitask here i keep getting messages left and right and I'm trying to see if I can avoid my um, my video from being interrupted. So I'm going to text him off my watch. Give me a sec. The shit I got to do, eh? Oh, boy. Hope you guys don't mind. So that should take care of that so I don't get a fucking phone call. All right, let's get into the lathering here because we have wasted enough time already. Yeah, so I hope you all are well and doing great, having a fantastic time. Um, I uh, will be taking off today, going back out on the road. And uh, I was supposed to take off in the morning, but um, something came up and the plans were switched around, but it is what it is. All right, Kevin is watching football. Yeah, MV Shave, man. You'll love it. You'll love it. <clears throat> now, I had this um, soap some time ago before. Um, and uh, didn't really do it for me. Because um, it smelled similar to another soap that I had. Um, 
but I decided to pick it up again just to see because you know scents do change for one for one uh, for for us at times and um, so I just wanted to see if maybe my my taste and scents has changed maybe I would uh appreciate it a little bit more this time around same thing with uh clown fruit uh, when i repurchased clown fruit um i wasn't a big fan of clown fruit uh the second time around as well but it is nice to have as a novelty you know the halloween theme So this is supposed to be a dark uh, scent. And uh, we'll see how we do. So let's get on with the shape. Ooh, dropped a big glob of leather. All right, let's get that back on there. Will is eating homemade pizza. My wife has made rice and taquitos and you guys know what that is it's uh shredded beef inside um or rolled should i say um rolled in a tortilla and uh fried you put a toothpick in between it to allow it to um keep its shape while you're frying it So we'll be having that right now with the uh, guacamole. Or for those of you guys, guacamole. For my non-speaking, my non-Spanish uh, speaking friends. And rice as well. Titty, what's going on, brother? I haven't seen you in quite some time. I hope all is well with you, brother. An Imperial Stout. All right. Hey, that's worth being late for, man. I'm not mad at you. Gray Dog, what's going on, brother? He's making cakes, Gray Dog says. Now supposedly, this is supposed to like evoke the, um, like a fall scent, like uh, decaying leaves and stuff like that. Um, it's got some cocoa and other stuff in there. I can actually taste the cocoa or chocolate, whatever the hell's in here. But it does have this nice, um, it's got a nice dark fragrance to it. So actually, uh, this versus clown fruit, um, um, this one actually has changed my mind on the scent. So I do not mind this one. Man, this stuff can take water like crazy. All right, so let's see how we do it here. Um, everyone loves cake. Alistair, what's going on, brother? I appreciate you joining. Mm. 
Well, Alice, you're making some bomb ass um, salsa there, man. Salsa, I'm, I'm assuming, right? Yeah. <clears throat> Yellow with chocolate frosting. Yeah, thanks, brother. I really do appreciate it, uh, Titty. I'm glad you, you can join, too. All right, so let's get into the shave here. Let's see how we do. So this blade has got, uh, in fact, let me go a little higher up on these sideburns. If you guys can see, I got my hair cut the other day. So I got to go up a little higher on the sideburns. Let's see how we do with this blade. It's got, um, I don't know, like two shades on it. I don't remember what blade it is, to be honest with you. All right, so it's shaving nice with, without a spine. Excuse me, spit all over the fucking camera. Wow, that is actually very smooth. That is very, very smooth. And I have, um, I don't know, like two days ago, three, no, like three days ago, I think. I already lost track, sorry. That is awesome. Kevy, what's going on, brother? Glad you can make it, Kevy. I appreciate you joining. Wow. I hope that this push uh, button, I don't, I, I don't know what it's called. I think it's called a push button. Push type, push button, whatever the hell it's called. Um, I hope this shape continues like this, man, because it is a very smooth razor. Now, this scent might not be for everyone. That is for sure. It is a, quite a dark scent. But if you like dark scents, <clears throat> I think you would appreciate it. And I actually do like dark scents. So I like, I really dig this here. Man, this is thick. It takes a lot of water. And I love thick uh, lathering soaps. I love me a soap that can take a lot of water. All right, second pass. Cross grain. The setup uh, we're using today, uh, Kevy, is uh, the Barrister and Man set. Um, Hallows, uh, there is a side label. I'm sorry guys, I forgot to show you guys a side label. 
and it's got a like a like a metallic holographic uh color to it there you have it if you guys want to screenshot that i'll do it again since this is not a uh so this is a live shave, sorry, what should I say? Um, matching aftershave balm, since he doesn't do uh, alcoholic aftershaves uh, for the time being because of COVID, uh, the lack thereof uh, um, alcohol base. So we're gonna go in with the fine. Um, and then uh, going in with the gym with the push type button. And I don't know what babe we have in here. Not today. <laughs> Oh my God, let me see. I didn't know you were my bathroom. My daughter wants me to show you his, her buddy. <laughs> here you go. Now I got here all over my fucking hands. All right, so let's get into the shave, cross brain. Kevin, you got Riley, your dog, and I got a bunny. How you like that? Wow, I cannot believe how smooth this razor is. So far, this is the smoothest uh, uh, single edge blade I've used. So far. Wow. Yeah, I know what razor I'm getting next. Luckily, these razors are very affordable. And um, I've seen these pop up quite a bit. Now, I don't know if... I don't know the rarity of the years they came out with, but hopefully I can find this one here without a problem. That is really, really good. You're gonna name him Kareem? <laughs> Mrs. Kevin says she wants a rabbit. Rabbit tallow. <laughs> uh, I, uh, my daughter doesn't know what that is. So I don't want to tell her. <laughs> uh, let me see. Um, hey, I appreciate it. Um, yeah, the strokes feel really good, uh, Will. Really, really good. Ian, what's going on, brother? Glad you can make it. <laughs> Alice just said, oh, bunny. <clears throat> use it to lather. <laughs> uh, Kevin says to use your bunny dog so I can lather, baby. 
And then uh, Kevin said, uh, cute looking bunny. Oh, thank you. My daughter says, thank you. You should have known it was going to be a Halloween thing, Kevin says. Yes, sir. Sorry, guys, I missed a few comments here, so I'm going back and seeing what I missed. All right, let's see. Sorry, it's because um, I got a little bit of, the, of a delay. Just I'm using my laptop. Man, you guys have seen how much water I put into this. And this stuff is really good stuff. Yeah. the final pass and see how we do here. What an amazing razor. And that's without a spine. You know, if it wasn't because of Cap letting me borrow these razors, and especially if it wasn't because of Jeffrey, I would have never gotten a chance to try these kind of razors. Only because I know nothing about them, and I don't, <clears throat> I don't know which ones to get, which are good, which are bad. Um, be able to buy, 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 and then figure out none of them are working for me. You know, it's it's that's the beauty of it of trying different blades and razors that were sent on a loan for me, man. Because man, that it's that's that's awesome. So again, thank you, Jeffrey, and thank you, Cap. So, Kevin, I heard that uh, you were coming on, and I was going to use this razor today, but since I heard you were coming on, I, I didn't want to make you nervous, so I decided not to use it today.
Just fucking with you, Kevin. Yeah, so I'm getting getting gonna get into the cleanup passes now. Yeah, I wish Tony was here too. But then again, what good friend would send you a broken razor? And what person would use a broken razor from a friend who sent like that? You guys are some weird friends. Man, awesome. <laughs> Medieval torture device. <laughs> you have loved using the, the valet. He had an amazing shave with it. <laughs> Another live shave uh, soon, Kevin. <laughs> The valet combined harvester. <laughs> Man, really digging this shave. I like the bottom of this handle here that the way you hold it, it fits just perfectly when you go up against the grain. It's not just for looks, it was actually made, meant that way because it fits just, just perfectly, like a glove. Wow, that is amazing. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's a pimple. Shit, I didn't even notice that I had a pimple there. Can you see that? The bump? Huh. <clears throat> All right. Let me go ahead and uh, rinse off, guys.
Man, <clears throat> fantastic. <clears throat> All right, let's get in with the elm stick. <clears throat> Yes, yeah. Or as Kevin likes to call them, spots. This is an old blemish, but yeah, you can see that's a pimple there. Fantastic. Well, All right. <laughs> It'll be fine. My wife is complaining because I got a bit of dots of water on the laptop. Oh man, what a fantastic shave. All right, what did I miss? What did I miss? And you guys are texting me. You guys are texting too fast for my dumb ass. Yeah, I've said it before and I said it again. I got the reading level of a fourth grader, so yeah. Yeah, I am very impressed with the blade too, Alex. Very, very impressed. <clears throat> yeah, see, that's the thing, uh, uh, Will, is, um, I've heard that from Tony and I heard it from Alex saying that the feedback sounds good. Um, I can't really tell what the feedback sounds like, although that I'm using it, the, the, the feedback comes off of cross camera really well to the guys. Um, I have to watch back some of these, uh, gym blade videos to see what the feedback sounds like, <clears throat> but thanks. I appreciate it. Will. yeah, I'm really loving these gym razors too, Titty. I think the I think the the razor that I'm using is called um um a uh, pace. I think it's a P A C E if I'm not mistaken. <clears throat> um Also, Teddy, you got the push button too, huh? Can I show off the blade operation? You join late. Okay, yeah, I'll show you right now in just a minute. Uh, Chris, thanks for joining, Chris. I appreciate it. Chris Nolan one. Or we call them blocks <laughs> to its Dundee thing, Manny. Yeah, I was nervous uh, when I tried the. Well, I was nervous after I tried the gym blade because I tried the gym blade with the gym razor from my local pharmacy uh, store and the, the shave went so well, but I guess I had my new weepers all over the place when I applied the aftershave or the alum. Oh man, my face was just red raw. I didn't really notice the, the issue. Uh, it might've been that the soap had really good healing properties to it, but afterward, man, it was a horrible, horrible shave. <clears throat> it left me red raw, and ever since then, I couldn't use any gem blades because I was nervous about using them. Um, and then every once in a while, I go back to them, but man, they were they were horrible. <clears throat> I was um, answering Ian's question or uh, Ian's comment. Um, 
or responding to Ian's comment, sorry. Um, yeah, man, if you, uh, uh, um, Kevin, if you can get into um, or know someone in the area who can let you borrow the, the, the razor or um, the blades, a diff different or let you let you try out some different blades man um i really think you'd, you'd appreciate it um um yeah really really good stuff man um highly recommend them um i i am blown away with this razor absolutely blown away <clears throat> Get some more there since I removed it. Now, <clears throat> it'll be my first time trying out. Look at this, we still got plenty, plenty of lather. Look at that. <clears throat> there we have it. Let me uh, <clears throat> rinse out my brush, okay, guys? Still got soap in there. Nineteen fourteen. Yes, I tried one of those two um, um, uh, great uh, compliments of um, Cap as well. So the shave turned out fantastic, uh, Ian. The Micromatic. I didn't do too well with the Micromatic. I wasn't very comfortable with that one. Um, I had. I think I used the open comb uh, or and the solid, solid bar. I don't remember. I have to go back to my videos. Yeah, yeah. See, uh, Alex remembers that too. I didn't like the Micromatic. All right, so let's go ahead and use the bomb here today. And because Will, I don't recall Will ever making a bomb. And I'm going to scrape off what's on the side here because I did spill over. Luckily, it didn't, it didn't, um, I didn't lose any in transit. Um, I'll show you what the bomb looks like right now. But um, it did start to spill out of the tin. Um, so give me a sec and I will show you what that looks like in just a second. Woohoo! Almost lost the cap. All right. So I'm going to add a little bit more. Yeah, so none of us, I believe, have tried. Well, that feels really good. Any of Will's bombs, because uh, I don't recall or remember him ever making an aftershave bomb. That feels really good in the skin. Wow. I know it looks like it's a bit greasy on the face, but it's not. It rinsed off the hands right quite easily. So that I feel like this is gonna be a really good um, moisturizing balm. Wow, that feels really good. Mm. 
Mm, that smells really good. And this one actually smells more like um, almost like a, like drying leaves. Not bad, not bad at all. Okay, so this is what the bomb looks like. It's not really runny. Um, if you guys can see there, it's holding its shape, but um, you guys can see there. Um, but man, this is really good high-end bomb. Really, really dig this bomb. This is really good stuff, man. Highly recommend you guys try this out. Um, rinse this stuff off. I got shit all over the place. All right. Let me go ahead and show you what we use for the shape. So here's the gym razor. Um, show you how the mechanism works. It's got a button here. You push open. I uh, got a message. Come on, man. Uh, push button. It opens it up, and then you push it back. So here's how it goes. You push this. It pops it open. There is a blade there. And then you push this button here, and it closes the mechanism. Uh, what I did was um, I took the spine off. Let me clean this blade off. And believe it or not, this is what my beard does to the blades every single time. It is not rusted. My hair is just that coarse that it removes whatever the fuck is on the blade. You guys can see there. Um, I've actually used a brand new blade on live video uh, with the guys. Uh, and uh, the blade is brand new as you use it. And as soon as I'm done with my shave, they look like this. So that's pretty crazy, right? <laughs> um, but so what I did was I removed the spine. This is a normal gym blade. So remove the spine because I wanted to use it in this razor because you can use different types of gym blades in this, in this, in this, in this, uh, uh addition. Um, uh, the V1, if I'm not mistaken, Alex, um, please note it down for people who, uh, who would like to know. And, um, if that didn't work, I also had a feather blade. So they look se some, somewhat similar. Um, so you can actually put the, the, you can actually put the, um, the spine from the gem onto the feather and then use them in your gem blades if you like. So... Um, I was just experimenting with it and I noticed something and I said, damn, I already removed the spine off of this razor um, and how am I going to use it? But what I noticed that it's got these, the old school um, divots back here. I don't know if you guys can see them. Um, I don't know, somewhere back here on this side and on that side. These center ones are just for the bottom posts here the rivets but this helps raise the blade to give it more in an angle but since this one didn't since i already had taken off the the uh spine i only figured hey it might work even better um because it's not going to have it too uh too aggressive so um that's how that works there again we went in with hallows um their halloween seasonal uh, uh theme soap we went in with the matching aftershave balm um, there's a soap all dried out now. Um, we went in with the aftershave splash uh, to give, you know, I have to have a burn in my shave every single time. And then I went in with the eight ball uh, Envy shave um, with a uh, 24 millimeter um, Black Wolf fan knot and then followed up with the, with the alum there. And um, if you guys are interested in the ingredients, um, I will sh try to keep it steady and you guys can uh, screenshot it while I spin it here. Here's the ingredients for the bomb. Don't know how clear that comes off on camera. I'm doing my best, sorry guys. So hopefully that comes off on camera. So that is that. And uh, that will conclude the shave. Cat, you joined late, my friend. <laughs> but I'm really glad that uh, you did jump on. Cap, um, I used this one today. Cap, this is by far one of the best uh, SE rages I have ever used. One of the smoothest, uh, efficient, um, 
I have nothing bad to say about it. Cap, I used a gym blade with no spine in this one. I don't know if you've tried a no spine gym blade in this razor that's got the um, the raised posts in the back, um, but it gave an excellent, excellent shave cap. Thank you very much for letting me borrow this razor. Um, let me see. Yeah, really, really liked it, Cap. Thank you. One of your favorites. Yes, sir. All right, guys. Um, anyone try the old wedge blades? Um, no, I haven't. Um, if anyone has tried a wedge blade, I'd probably say Cap has. If not, Jeffrey. Oh, you were working, I see, Cap, okay. Carbon steel blades being bad. Yeah, I've heard that carbon steel blades are, are having problems um, with, some, with some folks. In fact, myself as well, um, um, Kevin. Brilliant shave. Thank you, Arthur, I appreciate it. Yeah, Kevin, it feels really hydrated with this bomb. Really good stuff. Highly recommend you guys try it out. It took you a few a few tries or a few days to try out the MMC Open Comb Micromatic. Yeah, that's what um that's what Cap said, uh, Titty, that it takes a few tries. Um, but uh, yeah, it felt just very um. It felt like there was uh, like metal metal shards as I was shaving. Um, got another message. Um, it just felt yeah. It didn't feel as comfortable as I as I'd hope. Um, maybe I do got to try it out again. Um, but since they are unknown to me, um, I'm trying to get these razors um, used up as quick as possible so I can uh, send them on back to where they came from. Um, but uh, yeah, that is my shape, guys. I really appreciate all of you joining. Um, you guys really made my day. Um, it's really nice to have interaction with uh, a few people uh, while I do my live shares, and I really uh, appreciate that again. So that is my shape. I hope you guys enjoy. For anyone who watches the video as a replay, uh, hope you guys enjoy. If you guys do, please like, favorite, share, and subscribe as always, and I will catch you all in the next one. Be also safe out there. Later, guys.